All right, welcome guys. We're gonna do a quick video showing the different devices and how they compare to the Madrox Safeguard since the Safeguard is not as available right now. So I'm gonna start off with Edelrid Eddy. This is a little more on the expensive side. It's the largest one and we'll give you the specs in the notes below the video. So what I'm gonna do is I'm getting them up around head height. I'm gonna take tension off the rope to show how they can slide down and compare them to each other. So you can kind of see there, take, if you take full tension off, it can slide down. As soon as you put any tension on though, it's gonna grab. All right, I'm gonna switch off. Petzl Grigri Plus. Next up. All right. So with a little wiggle, it will slide as well. Next up, Virgo Trango. And you can see that one does slide just a little bit. And the uh, BL Birdie. And this one can slide as well. You'll see that they all do slide, even the safeguard. So we got to wiggle a little bit harder to get the slide, but it will slide when there is no tension on there. Just got to wiggle it quite a bit, but it does even slide. So. What is our recommendation? If the preferred one, the safeguard is not available, let's just go back to the birdie. Our recommendation is a 13 and a half inch hollow block used as an auto block. There are other options, but this is one that we have tested. So with an auto block above the birdie, you can see it can only slide so far because it is going to be caught by the carabiner and it won't slide past that. But this is still adjustable by just simply pulling up on it. The, the birdie will tend the auto block. So nice and smooth, but this is going to catch if there is no tension on this one to catch. So this is our recommendation for any of these mechanical devices to always have a backup. None of them are certified for hand-free use, so we do recommend a backup, even on the safeguard.